Welcome to Philippines Update. For today's video, I am going to take you to the local market to see the current prices of the fresh produce and meats. I made a video about cost of living in the Philippines earlier this year. If you want to see that video, I will put the cards up here. This video is the update for October 2021. Now, if you want to see the current prices in the Philippines, come join me as I walk through this flea market. Tara! Let's go! This section is where you will see the general merchandise like clothes, bags, shoes, and even kitchen supplies. Now, let's go on our first stop. Can you guess where we're going first? Of course, none other than to get some rice. Filipinos can't live without rice. As we all say, rice is life. Here we have a selection of different type of rice. Yes, there's different type of rice. And the price range is around 35 to 41 pesos. That's roughly around 75 cents US to 85 cents. And now, we got our rice. Let's move on to the next one. We are headed now to the fruit section. Before anything else, I want you to keep in mind that the prices of the produce differs between provinces. For example, this mango, we import this from Marinduque province, which is quite far from Montalban Rizal. So it will cost more here but if you live in Marinduque, the price would probably be 50% cheaper because they grow mangoes there. I hope that's clear. This beautiful mangoes cost 45 pesos for half a kilo. And that's a dollar. The papaya costs 49 pesos for one piece. That's roughly one dollar, and I think that's quite expensive to be honest. And we're also buying a watermelon here. As you can see, she is cutting a triangle through that beautiful watermelon to show us that the watermelon is ripe and ready to eat. This watermelon costs 3 US dollars. Let's walk around and see what else we can grab here. Over here, you can see that the egg prices vary depending on the size. Yes, that's right. The price range for eggs start from 4 pesos each to 7 pesos and 20 centavos. That is roughly around 17 cents US. Next up is the seafood area. This milkfish is one of my favorites and it costs 168 pesos for one piece. To be honest, as a local, I think it is expensive. And I am not used to this kind of price. 168 pesos is $3.31. To put that in a perspective, it may not be that expensive for you, but for local who's earning a minimum wage, this will cost one-fourth of their salary for the whole day. And that is expensive. Imagine feeding a family of five with a minimum wage salary. It will be very difficult. Now, this mackerel scad, or what we call galunggong, 
This is one of the most famous fish in the Philippines and it's well loved by the locals. Now, it costs a wafting 200 pesos. 200 pesos? I am actually in shock because I can still remember when I paid for the same fish for 100 pesos per kilo. Now, it's 200. 200 pesos is $4. Now, here's a tip for you. If you're an expat or a future expat watching this video, did you know that you can ask the vendor to clean the fish for you? Yes, that's right. And it's free of charge. Okay, let's keep going. Now to the meat section. Skip this part if you're a vegan. The chicken costs 160 to 180 pesos per kilo or $3.50. And this particular piece that we just picked out costs $2.15. And three slices of pork chop now costs $3.13 or 158 pesos which is very expensive to be honest i might be better off being a vegan now after those prices now let's move on to the healthier stuff the veggies we just pick up a few veggies here. We have some beautiful tomatoes, onion, potatoes. Garlic. Bell pepper. And some green chilies vegetable pear This bag of beautiful veggies costs us $2.49 or 126 pesos. I hope this gives you a little overview on what actually the cost of living in the Philippines. If you want me to make more videos about the cost of living in the Philippines, do not forget to hit the like button, consider subscribing, and turn on your post notification bell so you won't miss any updates from the Philippines. If you have any video suggestion, please feel free to comment down below. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys on the next video. Keep safe!